much. We're back into my original filming location because I didn't feel like sitting on the floor today, which is surprising. Watch next video, I'm gonna be on the floor again. But um, I don't have anything to do today. I just want to look gorgeous. So get ready with me to do nothing but sit here and look pretty. <laughs> Primer. Elf power grip. No, I literally have nothing to do. Um, but I do need to post a video. But I do want to look gorgeous. So let's just do all that at the same time. Guys, look what I got. Well, I didn't buy it. I didn't steal it. <laughs> but I got steely. I feel so like professional. Not professional. Put together. But um no i told my sister that if i did her nails she had to give me her stanley so we made a deal and i got her stanley and i did her nails <laughs> that's a fair trade bitch i really don't have much to talk about like i really don't like i'm just here this, i'm here to just film this video like i don't have anything i want to talk about this is just gonna be a get ready with me i honestly have been up to nothing <laughs> like i don't do anything ever i haven't that's really pale. <laughs> this isn't the foundation I'm gonna use. I'm just covering the pimps. I feel like I want to do more on my channel. Why do you guys keep asking like, can you do story times still? I feel like I've told all my fucking stories and now I'm boring because I'm sober. Well, I'm not boring. I'm a better person now, but like I don't get in any trouble anymore. So it's like, I don't really have crazy stories. Like, all the bad things that I used to do, that's a different version of me. Like, I don't have much to talk about when it comes to things like that anymore. Um, all I do is just, like, abide by the law and, like, fucking go to work. And I'm, like, a productive member of society. I don't <laughs> do anything crazy anymore. I'm becoming a woman, bitch. Like, I don't know what to tell you. I wish I had more stories. I can start lying. Do you guys want me to start lying? <laughs> Let me know if you want me to just start lying. But like, I wish I had more stories to tell. Like, everyone's always like, story times, story times, story times. Bitch. I don't have crazy stories anymore. I feel like I've told them all. Maybe I haven't. Maybe there is more stories I could tell. I just don't remember. That's also happened. Like, I don't like remember shit. I don't remember half my life. I don't really know. I think it's a sign of trauma. <laughs> I don't remember things, bitch. All the things I used to do. Just touched my leg and I had Vaseline on it. I got a new tattoo, but it's not finished. I'll wait until it's done to show you guys, but it's really gorge. Most of my job, like, even, like, you guys can be like, oh, talk about your life, talk about your job. I can't really talk about my job because it's, like, I have to keep things confidential because it's people's lives. So it's like, I can't even talk about that. Because Loki, I do have some crazy stories about work, but I can't talk about them because fucking HIPAA, bitch. My manager at work, <laughs> she was like, your TikTok popped up on my For You page. I was like, which one? <laughs> and I was like, you know what? I should block her. But I was like, you know what? No, I'm not going to block her because it's okay for her to see my fucking social media because I'm not different in person. I mean, like, I'm definitely more tamed at work. I don't want to get fucking fired, <laughs> but like, it's just so funny. And she was like, I didn't stalk you. And I was like, girl, you can, I don't care. <laughs> but that's just crazy. Cause no one at work really knows that I do social media. That's so crazy. Like my coworkers, they don't really know about all this. I'm like Hannah Montana, just kidding. <laughs> no, I'm not. Not as cool, but it's kind of crazy. They don't know. But like, this has been like my job for years, but they don't know that. I don't want to go around and be like, hey, guess what? <laughs> I don't know. Okay. I low-key love the way I do my makeup, but like, I feel like I d am not doing my makeup the most flattering as it can look on me. I wish I could go to like a professional and be like, what is the best makeup style in like thing for me? I wish someone could tell me that. Like, I feel like to reach my full potential of beautifulness, I could have a different makeup style. And I think that, like, I don't know. Like, I, I feel like a bad bitch when I do my makeup, but I feel like to reach my full potential, there's 
I feel like there's a makeup style for me. I just don't know it. You know? You know what I feel like I want to make a video about? Products that I will always repurchase. And I was literally just going to sit here and tell you guys every product that I will always repurchase. But I feel like I could use that as a video. Should I just tell you guys? I might as well. Like a whole video dedicated to that. I guess I could make like a TikTok. But... The products that I will always fucking repurchase. First of all, Panoxyl. That product has saved my fucking skin. I've gone through like five bottles of it. Um, that's like skincare. Is the the Elf Holy Hydration Makeup Cleansing Balm. I'll insert pictures of the products I'm talking about. But that has made my skin change too. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, bitch. For years, I used to be like, whatever, makeup wipes don't matter. I've even said this in a video. I used to be like, it's fine that I use makeup wipes because I just wash my face immediately after. Bitch, I was so wrong. I was loud and wrong. Wrong. I started using a cleansing balm and my skin changed. Using a makeup wipe and rubbing my face was irritating the fuck out of my acne. And it was making it so inflamed. So I started using a cleansing balm and then like double cleanse. Bitch, that changed so much. So, Holy Hydration from e.l.f. Um, literally saved my skin. I've rebought that one probably like four times. So bomb. Um, another thing that I'll always revive is e.l.f. Power Grip. The primer I just used. That primer is so bomb. Um, these two foundations I've repurchased so many times. The Essence Keep Me Covered and Maybelline Superstay. I've been using Maybelline Superstay for years. Back to when it was the 24 hour one, now it's 30 hour. I've always used that one. I'll always repurchase that. Concealer. This is the first concealer that I've actually rebought so many fucking times. I used to always use the e.l.f. camo one and I realized it was making my skin break out and I was like, oh my fucking god. So then I started buying this one and I've rebought it like four times now. The Juvia's Place Concealer Bitch and it's so good. Um, another one that I will always repurchase, Wet n Wild Photo Focus Powder. Guys, I've been using this for years. I literally like will use high-end ones and then I always come back to this shit. It makes you look like a porcelain little doll. Oh my god, it's my new fave. Toffee to be lip liner from L'Oreal. I've rebought that one already so many times. It's actually like my favorite lip liner I've ever used. I literally tried it for the first time on camera and it was like, it changed my life. <laughs> I'm not even being dramatic. It changed my life. Um, what else yeah that one is one that i'm like i'm so loyal to now i will always fucking use it the nyx thick it stick it brow gel i'm fucking loyal as fuck to that i will always use that essence lash princess mascara loyal as fuck to that i will always use that something i want to mention it's another skincare product i've actually never used something that clears my fucking cystic pimples so fast like i don't know what the fuck they put in this shit but it's like actually so good it's kind of expensive it's like 45 dollars but it's the murad deep acne relief treatment why the fuck does no one talk about it why does no one maybe they ha maybe they do maybe i'm just not paying attention enough but bitch it's crazy how good that stuff works like when i fucking used that for the first time i was blown away so the way i use it it looks like this the way i use it is all cleanse my face oh snail mucin actually works <laughs> that's another thing that i've like repurchased multiple times now it's really not like a scam bitch it really does make a difference um it repaired my skin barrier anyways the murad deep acne relief treatment bitch if you struggle with just pimples you don't even need to struggle struggle with cystic acne like it clears regular pimples too <sighs> so i cleanse my face i put on the snail mucin and then i put on moisturizer and then um, at night, I'll put, or if I'm not going to put makeup on, I'll take a Q-tip and I dip it in the Murad treatment and I put it over, like, a tiny little layer over my pimples and then I go to bed, I wake up and it's either gone or, like, a million times smaller. I've actually never used something that's so fucking effective. But I'm telling you right now, bitch, that Murad stuff is, like, life-changing. Like, you need to try it. I know it's a lot of money, but you need to. I've never used something so effective. It sounds like this is a fucking paid ad, but it's not. It's really that good. I used to wear a lot of bronzer and I really looked British and like no hate to the British bitches, they're gorge. But like I was going overboard. This is I act like this happened so long ago too. Like this was just like a month ago. But like I came to the realization and I was like, whoa. <laughs> I was like, that's that's not okay. For me, it's not okay. So I stopped. 
and I try to like just contour a little bit like I mean it's still a lot but like <laughs> it was more it was more than that but now I just don't do that as much and I try to like focus more of my like to bring out my cheekbones I use a lot of blush but also I tone down the blush too I don't know I just like noticed I was starting to look crazy and I needed to stop <laughs> you know what's kind of sad I miss having friends <laughs> like I don't know I miss having a best friend like a bestie like one that you can just like I don't know the ones that you literally can just like be in the same room with and like lay there and, and talk about nothing for hours and just like sleep and just be besties and like nothing else matters you know what I mean like I just miss having a friend like that and it's sad and I feel like I haven't had that type of bestie since my like last best friend I've talked about her before but like the one that I had the tattoo and then I we have ta matching tattoos and then she got hers covered and so I covered mine too that whole situation that happened like I don't know we haven't been friends since like 2020 but that's like the last bestie I had that was like my bestie like I have best friends now but like it's just not the same and I miss having a friend like that bitch I'm fucking lonely <laughs> I don't hang out with no one it's been so hard to like find like a real I guess I'm not looking how do you make friends, bitch? I don't know. <laughs> like, I'm being serious. Where the fuck do you meet friends when you're fucking 23, almost 24? Where do I find these bitches? I just want a bestie that I can literally just, like, do nothing with. And, like, it's fine. Like, I just want that again. Like, I feel like life is better when you have that, like, ride or die bestie. And, like, my best best friends they all live far away from me like michelle hey bitch i know you're probably watching this video <laughs> it's so funny i love michelle i never talked about this i don't think but michelle was like she watched my videos i don't know for how long i think like for a couple years and then she invited me to a concert and we went and then we became best friends so <laughs> what i tell y'all that like if you're ever near me and you want to hang just hit me up because <laughs> I'm serious like but like she knew me from my YouTube like I didn't meet her in like person first but now she's like one of my besties she just lives in LA and I'm in fucking San Diego but I talk to her every day she's my bestie but my other bestie Riley the one that I've been friends with forever she fucking lives in Sacramento and I'm fucking in San Diego and that's really far like at least Michelle I could just drive to in like two hours but fucking Riley that bitch is like I have to get on a plane and last time I drove from Sacramento and saw her, I was on my way home and I like wanted to die. Like, and I, it's not an exaggeration. I actually was gonna run my car off the road. I'm not, I'm not exaggerating. Like, you know when we say like, oh ha ha, oh I wanted to die. No bitch, I was gonna do it. It's not funny. It really isn't funny. But so fuck that drive because it makes me wanna wanna die for real. I swear I was like hallucinating that's how bad it was like I was literally driving like on that what is it the five the five that goes all the way down through California I was like swear I was hallucinating because it all looks the same for like six hours straight and it's like actually terrible <laughs> so unless I had a friend with me I would never drive that again so that bitch just needs to come and visit me because what the fuck does Sacramento have to offer me <laughs> Last time I went there, I fucking took Molly and I thought, what was that noise? Last time I went there, I fucking took something and I thought it was fucking ecstasy and, or what did I think it was, Molly or, and one of the two, bitch, I thought it was one of those and then I, it was meth and I was up for like fucking days. <sighs> Worst experience ever. Oh, I think someone's knocking at the door. It was my fucking sister trying to get in the house. <coughs> Sorry. Anyways, why was I talking about that experience? I don't remember. No, yes I do. I remember. I want a best friend that is next to me that I can just hang with whenever I want. <laughs> do you guys know what I'm talking about? Like having a fucking bestie dude i fucking miss it 
I have no friends. <laughs> I do have friends, they're just far away. I don't have friends that live close to me. And it's honestly depressing as fuck, bitch. You wanna see my big old makeup bag? It's gorgeous, you can kind of see it right here, but. It has everything I need right here. Let me show you, give me one second. Oh, it's really heavy. It has everything. I got it on Amazon. And it has another compartment over on the top. And it's the best. I don't think that I say this enough, and I feel like I should say it more, but I just want to thank you guys for supporting me. <laughs> like, I'm so serious. Like, thank you for loving me because I love you, and I mean that. It's, like, actually kind of crazy when I really think about it sometimes. Like, I got, I'm like, I'm lonely, but then I'll be like, oh my god, I got all these people right here that are so nice and supportive of me. Like, what the fuck? Like, that's so cool. Um... I don't say thank you enough, but thank you for watching my fucking videos, for real. All the comments that, like, relate to me and stuff and are like, bitch, we're the same. I'm like, that makes me feel so good. <laughs> like, there's other crazy bitches out there. Like, I love that. Like, for real, bitch. And, like, whether you've been here since I started my fucking channel in 2018 or you're new, like, I fucking love you, bitch. Thank you for being here. Well, I'm gonna stop fucking with it because it's gonna get bad. I need to stop. Remember that Jenna Marbles video where she has like was she said something along the lines of like having the too much gene, like where she just does too much of everything? Bitch, that's me. Whether it's fucking you know going overboard with like trying to fix something and making it worse or just like doing too much drugs that's how i'm an addict <laughs> i do i do one thing once and i have to do it again every single day for the rest of my life i can't just do things in moderation like energy drinks bitch like there's no reason i should be drinking this much caffeine a day but it's because i'm fucking used to be addicted to drugs moderation is just not a thing for me it's like go big or go home <laughs> Like, with everything. This, too. Like, why can't I just chill? That's, like, not a possible thing for me to do. It never has been. I can never just do something like a normal person. <gasps> I just made that too big. I be in the dark, why bitches never sleep. <laughs> can you guys hear the music? I fucking registered for my REDT to be um to go to school to be a drug and alcohol counselor. Isn't that fun? I fucking registered for it. Now I have to go to school, which I thought I would never do. Oh my god, that's crazy. Imagine telling my drug addict ass self a year and a half ago, hey bitch, you're actually gonna get clean and go to school to be a drug and alcohol counselor. I'd be like What? <laughs> That's so crazy, the way life works, bitch. Life is crazy. That's crazy. Oh my god. I'm proud of myself. I really am. Okay, bitch. <laughs> the song. <laughs> that is so pretty. Why do I look like a little cat? Like a little kitty, 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 kitty. <laughs> Joe eyeliner my waterline hold on <laughs> I hate when things are packaged so fucking much like chill please chill this is in the this is from Nova Beauty called in the shade called ASAP I've never used it it's the first impression whoops Looks like this. Oh, it has a sharpener on the end. Okay. I think I'm gonna do like a cute little smoky thing. Oh, that is so pigmented actually. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I usually use this the Italia eye pencil and it like injures me because it's fucking wood and it's like 
Yeah. Whoa, I look weird. It'll look better. <laughs> Whoa, dude. That looks kind of crazy. Okay, I have this little star pen. I got it on Amazon. It's from... It rubbed off. I don't know. It's just a stamp. I think I'm going to put one... I think I'm going to put, like, two on the sides. I don't know. We'll see how I'm feeling. <gasps> so cute. Should I put two or one? Should I put another one? Wow, that's so fun. Should I put one down here? I don't know. Or up here? Should I just do one? Should I add another? I think I should add another. Should I add another? Wait, hold on. Whoa, I look really weird. I need something on top of my eye. Hold on. That's kind of crazy. <laughs> Damn, bitch. I'm like, get ready with me to sit in my room and Does that make sense? Get ready with me to sit in my room and look pretty. And I'm not feeling very pretty, bitch. <laughs> I need another star, I think. Should I put one, like... Hold on. Let's just put on lashes and see what happens. I'm not feeling very cute, bitch. Okay, bitch. I added a wing. It's kind of slay. I need to add lower liner. Or lower mascara. What? Gorgeous. <laughs> okay, talking to me lip liner. My fucking thing. I feel like I'm a true woman. I've, like, found my favorite lip color. Like, I feel like that's becoming a woman. I can see myself being a grandma still using this. Oh my god, am I gonna be a grandma with lip injections? Or am I gonna stop getting them? That's something I need to think about. Like, when am I gonna stop? Okay, this is my favorite lip combo. So I use this and then I'll go in with Nova Beauty Heaven and put it in the middle. And it looks so pretty. It's the prettiest little lip combo ever. Bitch, I feel like my face is missing something. I don't know. Let me... Is it the lash that's making me look weird? I guess it kind of looks like... Looks cute. <laughs> I'm gonna go do my hair and see if this gets a little cuter to me. I think I just got new eyelashes delivered in the mail, so maybe I'll change my lashes. Because what the fuck is wrong with them? This always fucking happens to me, dude. Like, what do I do to my lashes to make them act like this? Like, this is an ongoing thing. Like, every video I feel like I'm complaining about how my lashes look. Oh, I made them look better. Let me go do my hair in a cute little way. I think I have an idea, and I'll be back, okay? Love you, bye. Okay, bitch, final reveal. So cute. <laughs> I will leave every product that I used down below, as always. Okay? Be good to your fucking brain or I'll beat you up, bitch. But you already knew that. Anyways, I love you so much and I will see you next week. Have the best week ever, the best day ever. Have the best life ever. Smooches, I love you so much. Goodbye. <laughs>